Hello everyone, welcome back to Blown Cartridge, this is Trevor, I'm here with Josh, and we are starting a new in Banjo-Tooie, the sequel to Banjo-Kazooie, because we basically just finished it and we wanted, to, we were not, we were not done yet, we wanted to do more, so. It's a, it's a new game, but essentially the exact same game. <laughs> it's the, it's a better version of the same game. Yeah. How come you take Notice a how, longer table? Huh? How come you took a longer table? Oh, the table? Yeah. Uh, it's outside. Well, because... Because I was I was doing other <laughs> because two years have passed since Cortella the Wish defeated by Michael. Close. Two years. Okay, so this is two years after the events of Banjo Kazooie. After falling from her tower, she was buried underground, where she remains until this ver until yeah until this very day. <laughs> I can't read. No, you can't. <sighs> How she could not survive on um, there um, for two Gern. years. Two years. She's a witch. She's magic. Her magic is not that strong. You notice how they also went to widescreen in the game, even though it's four by three, but it's like it's pan and scan. <laughs> what if we <laughs> letterbox the, this? Let's letterbox it, and it's still four by three because that's the extent of uh, Nintendo's sixty-four can do, and it's also SD, but it makes it look a hell of a lot more cinematic. I must say. And meanwhile, the boys are at their poker night, and they're all drunk as fuck. Mumbo looks different in Mumbo, this game. yeah, they fucked with Mumbo. They look pretty much the same, except they look like they have a little more sheen. They got bulgy eyes, too. Yeah, well, see how... Notice how Kazooie's got more, like, shine? Yeah. Banjo looks basically the same. They threw some gradients on... They put some gradients on there. Huh. Look at that cheating bitch. Bottles. So I guess we'll find out because Kazooie gets kidnapped, right? No, Kazooie does not get kidnapped. No, we we play as Kazooie and Banjo the entire game. I haven't played this game in a long time. I thought Kazooie. Got You're thinking of what's gonna happen once the game actually starts. We're gonna lose a good friend of ours in a little well, I know, bit. I know. I know. Look how fucking scary that looks. Look, like seriously. So here's the thing about Spiral Mountain. There's no way that they have any access to the outside world as of now, or the entire two years that they've been living in Spiral Mountain. There is no walls or anything to get out. Like, literally, they're just stuck in here. They're like one of those tribes that's, like, never seen any other civilization beside themselves. But now, in this game, we the get... Door. The door. The door opens. opens. Somebody gets to... Somebody drills their way through into Spiral Mountain on it by... I think... No, it's not even by accident. It's just... So he, basically, the three... I don't know how Mumbo got here, because... Oh, wait, no. He got here through Grunty's fortress. That's where they came out of to get into Spiral Mountain. Otherwise, I have no idea where the hell he came from. Or how he got here. <laughs> We're all... They're all different characters from different backgrounds and creeds <laughs> all living in somewhat Somehow they ended harmony. up in the same... The only person not living in harmony are Grunt, uh, Gruntilda, Gruntilda and uh, her helper... And Klungo? No, they lived up in the... In the... The fort? The, the... The lair. Yeah. And, uh... I guess basically everyone... Everyone who isn't... Who aren't... <laughs> who's Mumbo, not evil. Bottles, and Banjo-Kazooie are all evil. Yeah. Well, they're the only Into... five inhabitants of... Of Spar Mountain. Basically. Yeah, I mean... There's nobody else. There's not really a lot... There's one house. There's not a lot going on there. <laughs> Bottles just lives underground. Actually, we get to see Bottles' house uh, later, and we get to meet his family. Let's see. I was obsessed with that tank when I was a kid, so I like tried to recreate it out of Legos as best I could, <laughs> and I was like, really, really, it was awesome. Blabelda. Blabelda. These are Grunty's evil other sisters. That's not Brentilda. So she's got. The skinny sister whose the boobs were bouncing, I believe. I saw that. Did they have boob physics in this game? You know what else they did? Like, you notice, see how when they're talking, their mouths move yeah. when they talk. They didn't do that in the first game. It's very subtle. Stepping it up. The boob physics. No, they had the boob physics. At, remember when uh, when we would quit Banjo Kazooie when Grunty would turn. Yeah, hot? she would take the. I don't remember if there was any boob bounce though. So if you if you remember if there was any boob bounce, please say so. I think I would have noticed <laughs> in the comments. I would have noticed. Seems like the type of thing we would have noticed. <sighs> I keep I keep trying to watch the game, but I keep looking up at the Gotham poster <laughs> because it's right above there and it looks so amazing. And he's aiming his gun. I'm just at you. like, 
He's aiming his gun south east. It really makes me sad that Gotham spoilers ahead that his his uh, wife turns into. They're not. It's not his wife. It's well, his, 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 his girlfriend. girlfriend. You know, I was really rooting for her. Isn't his? But she's cool when she's evil, though. She's, but you know, she's supposed she's to. So nice and supportive. As yeah. a regular girlfriend. You know it's. A <laughs> you know it's weird because like she. She's supposed to be Batgirl, in the comics, but they're doing their own thing. I think we talked about that in another video already. But uh, she's kind of being more Harley Quinn-ish. So we'll see what happens. It's been a very good season so far. It's been very violent and very destructive. Yeah. <gasps> Mayhem. So apparently Grunty had other relatives that are outside of Spiral Mountain. <laughs> which, which begs the question. Although it would make sense. Living elsewhere. It would make sense that Grunty would be the only outsider to Spiral Mountain because she has the ability to fly. Oh, that's true. She Although, could have broomed her way Kazooie in Kazooie does too, so never mind. Well, Kazooie... Oh, that's true. But they didn't know how to fly until they learned it in Treasure Grove. Oh, that's a good point. So they you couldn't think, have flown yeah, out. Yeah, but you think Kazooie could fly... Kazooie could just come out of the backpack and fly on her oh, own, probably. Yeah, yeah. yeah. On her own. On his own. It's a girl. So he's a lady. Are you saying that Banjo taps that? <laughs> <laughs> Banjo they very taps. Like, they're, they're, just, very... they're very good roommates. Are they a couple? It's No. It's one of those situations where I've never seen this work ever, but I've known people that have convinced me that, oh yeah, my, my roommate's a girl, and then he's a guy, obviously, and I'm like, fuck you. It doesn't work. No. It never... How can you find me that that actually happens and it works, and... And show me, because I don't believe it ever works. When has the guy never made an attempt to just, tap his female roommate? I mean, come on. Just like open relationships don't work. Oh, yeah. It won't work. It won't. <laughs> it goes against the whole point of a relationship. Like, that is the point. It's unbelievable. I'm, look, I'm not saying, no, I'm saying Banjo is... He's not tapping the bird. He's just... He's, uh... They're just good roommates. They're just best friends. Frame rate drops here. We're getting for oh, we're gonna be seeing a lot of frame rate drops in this game. <laughs> Just from memory, I recall there being very slow movements during like when there's like a lot of shit going on. So we gotta get ready for that. That explains why uh, Kazooie's such a bitch to everyone. A bitch, old. because she can't fly away, and, or she's got a bear as a roommate. Well, she's a she. She's a she. Yeah. So. Oh, she. But she's a tomboy. And she's not getting tapped. <laughs> she wants that bear. She wants that bear. She's gonna meet some other birds, <laughs> and she'll, she she'll, lives in a backpack. <laughs> she'll be able to separate from the the backpack, which is awesome. And she's got some good moves on her own. Holy shit! Look at that frame rate. That Oof. <laughs> There's no way to speed it up either. <laughs> Jesus. We're. Uh, I'm pretty sure this is just how it was made and designed. This way. Yeah, I mean, we just didn't notice back then. Look, pant. Now you gotta have that crisp 60 frames a second. I mean, unless we were emulating this. Well, emulating would be 60 frames. Always, yeah. You'd be well, for the most part, we'd be, we'd be screaming. I like how we have a bottles picture right behind bottles on the fireplace still. We he's have, a, he's we, another good friend. We effectively have pictures of every inhabitant. <laughs> Where's Mumbo's picture, though? Tootie's picture was back there. It was on there, it when you picked the save file. Tootie doesn't even... Oh, that's... No, that's in the... Okay, whatever. No. That's another room. Is that supposed to be their room? I don't know. Oh. But there were three pictures, and Mumbo was one of them. I'm over it. We're playing the Mumbo. Hold on, file. girls. Why is your skeleton on the outside of her clothes? Oh, that's a great... Because it just rotted through the clothes. <laughs> the clothes just, like, Those deteriorated over... Those must be some good over, quality clothes. ...over two years. Oh, look, they're releasing... Uh, other species into the wild of Spiral Mountain where they will have nowhere to go. And they will mate and populate like rabbits. It's actually a biological ex exhibition. It's a sound plan. Exhibition. And they leave Klungo behind. Fuck that guy. Oh no, Klungo, you stay here. I'll be back, have no fear. I keep thinking there's more punch to her rhymes, and then I keep getting disappointed every time <laughs> I say them out loud. Ah, Klungo wanted to tap. Pleasant day. Klungo's just her manservant. I know. Look at the house got destroyed. 
The one house, oh, the the the, yeah. the one structure. the real estate, the one real estate structure in this in this part of the world that they are living in. In real life, that house would be extremely expensive. Oh hell Just yeah! Just because of location. Just location is everything in real estate, and uh, I I would say that's gonna go for roughly a million two fifty, like no less than a million two fifty, just for the sheer location and the size. Like there's houses in California that are just. They're tiny as fuck, but they're over a million dollars. Yeah, but that's that's shit of Fornia. San so. Diego. <laughs> Calus suck. Calus suck. Of yeah, that was the best. A lot of people have told me <laughs> not to live in California. Even though I'm like, oh, you know, I was thinking about it, and then they're like, don't. I went to LA <clears throat> and. Excuse me. The part I was staying in was okay. <clears throat> oh, uh, for your. Uh... Well, L.A. itself your, your trip. was, uh, terrible. Like... No, L.A., the city's horrible. Hollywood's nice, but there's nice areas of L.A., but there's uh, most of it's just a horrible city. It's just too much. They're gonna pay. They made Bumbo look a lot more feminine. Yeah. He's not as scaly. His eyes aren't, like, sunken in anymore. Or shamanistic, yeah. His skull's not as, like, hard-edged as he was. I think Banjo's probably the only, like, the least changed out of all of them. I think they gave him a bigger nose. I think so. <laughs> His nose is all over the place. Oh, man. Check out that frame rate. Yeah, that's pretty Oof. fucking terrible. Oof. Holy shit. All right. Dead body. Went up for a second there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> His I was the star of Banjo-Kazooie. Who's going to help you now? You can help me from the dead. Alright, let's see here. Wow, this frame rate is terrible. This frame rate's pretty bad. <laughs> I was knocked off the barbecue. Oh, from the last game. Remember they were cooking him? <laughs> but that doesn't make any sense. Oh, from He's... two years ago, though? So they were cooking him alive? That doesn't make Yeah, they were, because he was jumping up and down. I want to go back into the house. They also really weren't quick. here during that cookout. They were on, like, a beach island. They were on the How beach. How did they get there? No, 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 no. They had a. They had a, a beach. No, they were they were they had a backyard barbecue at the, at the at the end of the Grunty's Furnace Fun, but not the the whole game. They just had. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, so they had that. Where's the? Oh, the kitchen was there. And then it's ruined. But think of that island. No, then the but island was must, after but the, the whole. I know, I know, game. but they must have been outside of Spiral Mountain. Holy shit, that's a great point. So they how must, the fuck did they get they there? They must have a method. Of going in and out of Spiral Mountain. We have to we have to figure out how exactly we're trying to make a convincing argument this game as to has, how Banjo Kazooie is actually in real life and this, in the modern world. This, this is a this game has the deepest <laughs> deepest lore. It does. <laughs> Take it. I don't want it. I don't need to put my feet up right now. Notice how Klungo's got a. I kept thinking his golden eye was a uh, golden eye. Good was night. uh was a jiggy or a, a a thing? Oh wait, yeah, he's we can't. Those are useless to us now. So Spiral Mountain's pretty much been blown to shit. So they give you like a million eggs at once now. Yeah. Oh, we still have all our old moves too, which is awesome from uh, the last game. Wow, they're just handing shit out. Yeah, see, they 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 put they put stuff in clusters of five now, or well two for them, but. Uh, and we keep getting God, little this messages frame from. Frame rate uh, is terrible. Yeah, it's not too. It's not that great. We're probably we're probably pulling down what less than less than <laughs> thirty. There's some more rare boxes. Definitely. That do nothing. They straightened out the health bar. They st yeah, they straightened out the health bar, which is. I know I had this game, but I have pretty much zero recollection. There's Grunty's hole. <laughs> <laughs> Good one. Yeah. Just gonna go around and get what I can before we. Proceed. No one wants to live here now. The value of the house just went way down and well, Banjo didn't have any the, uh, insurance. All the view is destroyed, you know. Yeah. You can't go around destroying the landscape and expect the, the property to hold its value, you know. <laughs> but they don't give a shit about that, but this is the modern world, so we gotta make we gotta create that convincing argument as to why it is. It totally is. Somewhere deep in somewhere. And here's another thing. Oh, this waterfall implies oh, that, that Spiral Mountain is low geographically. <laughs> There's a door that only Kazooie can get into. We can't get in there yet. But I gotta remember to come back and. Uh... Wait, 
Kazooie like by herself? Yeah, Kazooie, there's a point where you can separate them and then there's things that only they can do by themselves and there's only moves that they can learn and uh, stuff like that. While we're up here, I mean, while we're down here, since we're low... Somebody. What are they just... Why are they handing all this out? I don't because see. this is just stuff that we learned in the last game. Why would you we, need the shoes here, though? Because if, in case you want them. Not for any particular reason, but, uh... What? Why? Fuck! <laughs> they, they just have them here so you can, like, fuck around with them? Yeah, I guess so. Why are you getting those? You don't need help. I needed one. Yeah, what do we need the boots for? Absolutely no reason, but we're gonna go up to Grunty's... What remains of Grunty's Fortress so we can say hello to Cheeto. And start getting pages for him because Cheeto. he will help us out greatly and it's very sad. Yeah. Because his uh, his pages got torn out. She got so frustrated by losing to us in the last game. She got so butt mad. She was rage. She was about to rage quit, but she rage quitted it on Cheeto. <laughs> and uh, we'll see what he looks like. He looks quite horrible. I to gotta the say, this, uh, this zone here looks better Yeah. in the other game. Oh, Spiral Mountain? They, like, added a bunch of detail to all the textures, which actually makes it look worse. <laughs> or slows the game down. <laughs> yeah, it slows the game. So here's poor Cheeto. Way down. And notice how we can't, uh... She ripped his pages, but she did not rip them out. You know, he didn't rip them all out. He had more pages, though. He had four pages. Yeah, we know who you are. <laughs> You're out of luck there, I'm afraid. Grunty ripped out all my pages because I helped you in the last game. <laughs> I love it. Just breaking the fourth wall just is hilarious in this game. <laughs> so self-aware. Alright, so we gotta get every five pages, then he gives me a little secret. You know what I just, for some reason, got a thought that, I, wanna, that I want to play? What's that? Toontown. Toontown Online? Yeah. It's not even a thing anymore. Well... Is it? Disney closed it, but there's Toontown Rewritten, which is people... What's Toontown? Oh, is that a fan-made thing? Well, it's the same exact game, but with a custom code and everything. Oh. Because apparently you're allowed to ringing. use the mm -hmm. assets, but not the code? I'm not really sure how that no. works, but... We ought to look into that, because I would love to play that again. I've already looked into it. It runs well. Oh, sweet. Because they closed I it. I haven't played it in a while, but... Yeah. Someone didn't think that one through. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna... <laughs> they didn't think go. that jump pad through. Oh, what do we got here? There's our first Cheeto page. I don't even need to fly to get this. You know what? So I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna lose my flight yet, because I want to go over and check out a secret. But, uh, yeah, over did you, here. Did you ever play Toontown back in the day? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that game was freaking sweet. It was dope. Like, way better Like, the stuff than you can I do to expected. the house. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it was awesome. But it probably runs, like, way better nowadays. We gotta, uh... Gotta do some videos of that. Yeah, that game was sweet. Behind the waterfall. Alright, so... There you can see is a Banjo-Kazooie cartridge. Yes. And we need to go grab it. Why? Oh, because, you know, I don't have the moves to get in there yet. Uh, just to get... I think it helps. I don't know if it helps you later. I, see, there's a lot of things about this this game I don't know yet. So we're gonna we're gonna come back for that once we have the right moves at our disposal. Well, that's another oh, nice. That's another reason this game <laughs> is set in the modern day. So there's <laughs> Why is a banjo kazooie cartridge there. If it were the past, mm -hmm. they wouldn't have or they to, wouldn't have that. Where did he? I mean, like, where did he get his backpack? He obviously doesn't have a tailor. Those shorts and the shorts. I mean, those but shorts... How do they make clothes? What, where's the economy? And they're clearly made out of some kind of, you know, nylon... <laughs> some stuff know, they just Kevlar, found. Kevlar, <laughs> you know... Kevlar. ...mix, because they're very strong. They're, yeah. They're, well, they, they survived a whole nine... Must be denim. Nine... <laughs> Must be yellow denim. See, no, that's my further proof that they would have had to have outside, like, exportation to get these materials. Yes. Because we're about to go see he the rest of the world, He probably bought them on Amazon. Probably got... But he didn't have a... Well, his computer just got destroyed. You're telling me he didn't have a computer? He had Xboxes. Oh, you're right, he did. You know what? He had a TV, too. Yeah. No, the little honeycomb TV. So is, the uh... technology is there. I don't know what's up there. We'll come back. We'll come back for that. Because I don't think I can get in there yet. Maybe I can beak bomb it, but, uh... 
All right, so this is Banjo and Kazooie basically going out. This is the farthest they've ever been. What's that line from what that Sam says in Lord of the Rings? He's like, if I take oh, one more step, this is the farthest away I've ever been from home. It's farthest away from home I've ever been. I've ever been. <laughs> come on, Sam. It's like the worst response. I hated that line. Like, come on, Sam. Like, I thought it was all right. That's not what you say to your friend. You'd be like... He's not a brave dude, though. He's got to say some, you know, shit like that. I mean, seriously, think no, about I knew, it. If you were I, just it was, in No, team, I mean, Sam's line was okay. I mean, Frodo's response, I oh, always come on, was Sam. Like a little... He just kind of held his hand and like, come on, Sam. Yeah, like, oh, Sam, can you... Sam's trying to be deep. And he's like, okay, let's go. When we when we marathon Lord of the Rings, I want to do I want to do that, that, that game where every time Sam and Frodo have a game moment, we finish a shot. <laughs> Which is... We're not, really wanted, we're not gonna make it. We're not gonna make it, but it's gonna happen all the time, and that's the problem. We're gonna start disputing what is and is. Not. Are you already fighting? Oh a fuck! Boss? I'm already fighting him. Holy shit! Uh, let's see here. Jesus. Oh, right. I just gotta pelt him, I guess. Just gotta pop. I gotta pop his rocks. He's got a magic shield. No. I think we have to fight this guy here. like three times, if I remember. Oh fuck! He's throwing bottles. I mean chemicals. That potion doesn't do much. Nope. Yeah. What what cave is this? This cave is like just was already hollowed out. It's the lair, isn't it? No, this is uh this is where the the, the sisters came through with their drill. Oh, yeah, I see their drill. So this whole cave was already here. Well, they yes. you, see, you can see the tire tracks, and we can follow the tire tracks all the way to the. Well, yes, but where that's went. that's implied because in the cutscene there was a pile of rubble there. Mm, yeah. So the but entrance, they had the place. the entrance was there, but how? But then they probably couldn't move the rocks, right? So that they was needed there. the drill just over tank. the two years of it getting, you know, did, the Spiral Mountain been in incredible disrepair, yes. as you can see, and then the two years it probably just fumbled. So that was probably there. Maybe it was there the whole time, and they just didn't realize it. So there is another world. You know what else is weird when we're thinking about this game overall? Mm-hmm. There's an ocean. <laughs> the ocean. There's an ocean. Oh no no no! You'll you'll see in, something. No, in Treasure Trove Cove. No, that's in. Uh, yeah, you're right. I don't know where that is. But that's sub but, subterranean. But see, if it was in Grunty's lair, the portrait. Wait. Transported you. Oh my God! No, this world is technologically advanced. <laughs> it explains why the animals can talk. What do you mean? I'm I'm getting. Okay there. okay. I'm getting there. All right, tell me. To get to Treasure Trove Cove, what do you do? You go into the into the chest. Into the box. Into the box. It's a microverse. It's a microverse. So are you saying all the universes are microverses? Well, some. Look, okay, like, see, Isle of Hags, that's where we are. We're on an island. Like, Spiral Mountain is on an island, and all this shit that we're about to see is the overworld that's on the island. So, and there's a point where we get to see, when we go to the last world, when you fly up, you get to see the whole world below you, and you can see where everything is. It's cool. So that kind of helps with the lore. But we'll uh, we'll see that when we... Uh... So we're in the Jinjo village. This is where all the Jinjos live. So we were collecting all of them last game. And this is this, these are where they live with their families. There's B1 next to the signpost. Let's check it out. What happened here? In loving memory of the gray Jinjo family. <laughs> passed away unexpectedly when a huge digging machine flattened their house. <laughs> <laughs> That's horrible. <laughs> what, they so drove much, through their house. There's so much implied there. Oh, no, so much carnage. Carnage. So carnage. we gotta... Connie's. So we gotta go get all the... <laughs> Connie's. <laughs> we gotta get all the... Uh... Oh, and about your thumb drive. <sighs> Did you find it? No, I told you that was lost. That's why oh, I gave you shit. the other one, which I also have because yeah. we were exchanging files. I need at least one of them. Well, I'll bring it back. Or bring me just one that you aren't using. Well, I'll bring you the one that I gave you is back. That, yeah, is that one 16 gigs? It I don't was, yeah. It was? Okay. Good, because I need to... Um, what I'm going to start doing is I'm going to start editing on the newer computer. And then I need to be able to transfer them from this really? one. Really? You're going to take the leap, huh? <laughs> Shut up. Shut the fuck up. Because it just runs faster. Okay, here's where Bottles lives. Wait so a gonna... second. That means Bottles knew that Spiral Mountain was cut off. Wait a minute, he knew... He was digging he in and out of there. He didn't live there. So he, why the fuck would he withhold that information and they never asked? He had a subterranean 
system mm -hmm. for getting around. His wife is hideous. <laughs> well, look at him. Although Bottles is, you know, Miss Bottles. not great himself. What is she drinking? She's drinking a banjo tooie merchandised she, cup. She's drinking a daiquiri. She went to the merch. <laughs> she went to the merch store. Look at that, BT. BT. Wait a second. <laughs> so look, this is only adding more They're to our. Self-aware. They are incredibly self-aware. BT. Or. Why isn't BK? Because technically they don't know they're in banjo tooie yet. Yeah, and also it's not. Well, any, yeah, they do. It, B, BT is not anybody's name. Like. No, it's just banjo tooie. Children! Notice the Jet Force Gemini poster up there. I seize it. <laughs> Jesus he's, Christ, and he's got they, a DK doll. They just, like, could not get enough. We love like, ourselves so much. We're just gonna... Referencing other shit. We're gonna cross-platform the shit out of our, of our titles. So basically, we're in Bottle's house right now, convincing his wife and kids that he is not dead, even though he is dead. And so we gotta cover up that little lie. The whole time. You're like, your dad is your dad, at the strip club. Your dad club. got killed. He's, uh... Let's take a look at Jet Force Gemini. That, you know what? That game is very hard to play It's very hard to play. Like, I tried playing that now. Mm-hmm. Like, you know, recently, and it just does not... And it not, wasn't fun? It just doesn't work. It doesn't work at all. Does he have a Pokemon Trader hat on? I can't tell. No, I just... No, that's a Z. Z. I don't know what that means. If I could see it better, I could pinpoint. Is that playing from something? Uh, I don't know. I bet it is. I bet Probably, Rare, Rare yeah. did some, like, pilot wings or some pilot shit. Oh, it might be, yeah. Yeah. I never or... understood pilot wings either. Did you know the tunnel over there is my secret way out of the village? <gasps> There's secret ways out of the village. These people... These people are hiding. Maybe Banjo-Kazooie tried to hide themselves. Hmm. Maybe they were exiled. Ooh. Ooh. Cause uh, maybe Shit. maybe Kazooie <laughs> was such a cunt that they exiled both of them, <laughs> and Banjo couldn't resist tapping that, so he went with her. Mmm. He didn't want to leave her alone because they were friends, and no, they didn't they want to feel together. bad. That's right. Holy shit! So he's clearly not gonna open that up for me, I guess. Hey. Yes. Ooh. Fucking hit it. Ooh. Uh. The fucking bitch. Wait, wait. Look at his hat. <laughs> All right. Um, fuck. You know, from in closer. Front of you him. mean? In front right. of him. And... Stand the. No, you stand fucking still. mole. Fuck. Come back. Specky. Are you fucking me right now? Are you <laughs> fucking me right now? Look at. That. Gotta block his ass. God damn, dude, you're terrible. I mean, yeah. Just awful. You realize? It's a Z. You wait can't... a second. This oh. child is like taller than you. Hey. He's uh huskier than me, sure. He's taller than I could take him. Hey. I'd fucking kick his ass. I seriously need to do a banjo. I'm gonna kick his ass next time on Blown Cartridge when uh, when we come back and go see the Jinjos. I was in the middle of saying something. You're gonna, Finish your you're sentence. Gonna, you're gonna end the video right now. I'm gonna end time? the video right now. I was just saying I need to do a banjo costume. Oh, hell yeah. Like, what are we gonna do? When we talk about that? Well, yeah, but I'd have to be shirtless. <laughs> well, you better so start. So I need to get in shape You better first. get in shape. <laughs> But uh, other than that, I'm already hairy, so I don't gotta worry about that. I just need a blue that. backpack and some yellow shorts. And you're good to go. I'm good to go. I'm good to go for next Halloween. Now you can end the video. <laughs> now I'm gonna end the video. Next time I'm blowing cartridge. This has been Josh and Trevor. We'll see you back for more Banjo Tui next time as we explore more Isle of Hags and get deeper into the already deep lore of Banjo and Kazooie. We'll see you next time.